Give it the whole 360. Release. Release the block. There's a lean. We are in the enclave. and the heated tile beds.
You lived your life like a candle in the wind Never knowing who to play it Exiting Princess Theater, you have the Take 5 Lounge. In the evening, there is Jazz Entertainment. And on the other side is the casino. To the left, there are some shops. To the right, there's the photo gallery. And then Facing the HM, there's Good Spirits Bar. It's not even 9 a.m., so the bar's not operating right now. This very morning, right, good. And now to replicate our cuisine in Mexico, we're gonna grab some Serrano peppers. All right, woo, arriba. Um, Linda, you said you like spice. How much spice do you like? Do you want, do you want one? Medium. After the shops, there's Future Cruise Center and a dining room. There are three dining rooms on this ship, two on this deck and one on deck five. There's another view of the atrium with the Good Spirits Bar directly across. And then around the elevators, we have the art gallery and the other entrance to the dining room. Just up the stairs to deck seven, we have many of the specialty restaurants. There's Alfredo's Pizza which is a specialty restaurant, but there's no charge. And then there's the sushi bar with a charge. And then there's a new restaurant. This is where the French restaurant used to be, a bistro that says something like that. And now it's The Catch by Rudy.
head aft. There's Princess Live Bar, Princess Live Theater, Crown Grill, Crown Grill Bar, and the Vista Lounge. Princess Live is a multi-function venue. They do quiz, trivias, they have entertainment here. And they've also got a coffee bar and a drink bar. Moving on from Princess Live. Vista Lounge is closed this morning, but they have lots of entertainment in there. They also use it as a meeting place and for private parties like the captain's party and the Elite Platinum Lounge. This is deck 16, the Lido deck. We are in the North Sea and it's 40 degrees, so I don't imagine we're gonna see anybody here today. During the day, they serve pizza over there, and then we have hamburgers and such on the other side. And here's a pool area that I don't imagine we're going to see anybody in for the whole two weeks because it's very cold. They also do movies under the stars. Yes, they're still doing it in 40 degree weather. <laughs> So on the Sky Princess, the Seaview Bar has been moved to the center. On Royal Princess, it's out over where the seawalk is. And the buffet, they call it World Fresh Marketplace. Exiting the buffet, there's an outdoor seating area. And then there is an infinity pool in the back, which in 40 degrees, not gonna be anybody in it.
some hot tubs upstairs, a couple of hot tubs, a bar, lots of lounging. And apparently there are staterooms on the other side of these glass doors. All right, we're still on deck 17. I just wanted to see what was down this way. Yes, okay. So from these staterooms, you can see the retreat pool. Continue on deck 17. There are a couple of hot tubs up here as well. Deck 17, view from under the movie screen of the pool deck. Pool bar. And there's also sliced pizza and the salty dog. And there are a couple more hot tubs, one on each side deck 17. Looks like not in use today. Although, believe it or not, the other ones are. It's this cold. There's snow in the mountains and people are in the hot tub. <laughs> not this Florida girl. More sun lounges on deck 17. Before we head up to deck 18, I just noticed they do have table tennis on 17. Okay, let's go up to 18. This is the sanctuary. It's not in use right now because it is very cold in Norway. There is a hot tub. And a gorgeous view. The view from deck 18 and the jogging track. All right, we're going to go once around the jogging track. I'm going to slow down for a minute because we're coming past center court. Pickleball. cabin right now and uh, bad weather, bad wind and and the boat's listing. Go ahead. 